And one of the first things that I like to do is I like to kind of explain who we are uh, so we get a good sense of what we're looking at uh, from the role that we're looking at it from. Today we are logged in as Jeremy Heath. And Jeremy is a fifth grade teacher at St. Edwards Elementary School. And one of the things you'll first notice when you log into Living Tree is that it looks a lot like Facebook. So if you scroll down the center here, we can see all of the posts that have been created in Jeremy's class and then school-wide posts and maybe any other posts that have been made to groups that he may be connected to. The second thing I'd like to point out is the left-hand navigation bar. The left-hand navigation bar allows us to quickly filter the post stream here to specific groups and specific things that we're, we're looking for. So in this case, if I wanted just things that have been posted to Jeremy Heath's classroom, I'd be able to click on Mr. Heath's fifth grade class, and then I would only return posts from that classroom. If let's say Jeremy had, uh, he was the administrator for the school's band club, then he could click on that and only return things from the band club that had been posted to that group. I'm going to clear our filter here. You can always clear the filter that you're on by clicking on clear filter show all. That'll reset this conversation screen. The next thing that I'd like to point out is our top navigation bar, which takes us through the different modules of Living Tree. So we have the conversations feed, the calendar, give, inbox, my network, and directory. And I can move between the, those different modules just by clicking on them. For instance, going into the inbox, I can take us into the inbox. I'm going to default us back to the conversation.